the earliest fossil amniotes are known from the early Carboniferous. These early amniotes would eventually evolve into the lineage which would become mammals. But prior to that, uh, diverse lineages of fossil amniotes would produce flying pterosaurs, dinosaurs, and then the surviving non-mammalian amniotes of today, the reptiles and birds. Amniotes as diverse as humans and turtles share a number of features which have been derived from these ancestral amniotes. This would include uh, new modifications of the skeletal system, such as a strengthened vertebral column, uh, reorganization of uh, nuclei inside the nervous system, increased uh, cardiac output and a common conduction system of the heart, uh, greater complexity of uh, the lungs and a lengthened trachea, uh, more salivary glands, changes to the lymphatic system, uh, modifications of the metanephros to make it the primary kidney. In the reproductive system, the amniotes were the ones which developed a penis and a clitoris. Uh, changes in embryonic development, such as those extra embryonic membranes which allow eggs to be laid on land. These features and more evolved in the early amniotes and are shared by modern amniotes.